A numbered Air Force NAF is a type of organization in the United States Air Force that is subordinate to a major command MAGECOM, and has assigned to it operational units such as wings, squadrons, and groups. A component numbered Air Force CNAF, has the additional role as an Air Force component command exercising command and control over air and space forces supporting a unified combatant command. Unlike MAJCOMs, which have a management role, a NAF is a tactical organization with an operational focus, and does not have the same functional staff as a MAGECOM. Numbered Air Forces are typically commanded by a Major General or a Lieutenant General. Numerical designations for numbered Air Forces are written out, without the use of ordinal numbers e.g., 8th Air Force instead of 8th Air Force, but cardinal numerals are used in abbreviations e.g., 8AF. Units directly subordinate to a NAF are generally numbered 6XX where XX is the NAF number. For example, the 618th Air and Space Operations Center, Tanker Airlift Control Center, is a unit subordinate to the 18th Air Force. Topic: History. Numbered Air Forces began as named organizations in the United States Army Air Corps before World War II. The first four NAFs were established as the Northeast, Northwest, Southeast, and Southwest Air Districts on 19 October 1940 to provide air defense for the United States. These air districts were redesignated as the 1st, 2nd, 3rd, and 4th Air Forces, respectively, on 26 March 1941. Over a year after the establishment of the United States Army Air Forces on June 20, 1941, the Arabic numerals were changed to the 1st, 2nd, 3rd, and 4th Air Forces on 18 September 1942. Other organizations established during this period and that became numbered air forces include the Philippine Department Air Force became 5th Air Force, the Panama Canal Air Force became 6th Air Force, the Hawaiian Air Force became 7th Air Force, and the Alaskan Air Force became 11th Air Force. After World War II, the U.S. Air Force continued to use both named and numbered air forces. While named air forces were used in both tactical and support roles, numbered air forces were generally employed only in tactical roles. As part of a peacetime restructuring in March 1946, the United States Army Air Forces were reorganized into three major operating commands the Strategic Air Command, SAC, the Tactical Air Command, TAC, and the Air Defense Command. ADC. These commands reflected the basic air combat missions that evolved during the war, and each reported directly to General Carl Spatz, the commanding general, Army Air Forces. Numbered Air Forces served as an intermediate headquarters between these commands and the operational wings and groups. Eleven of the 16 wartime air forces remained. The 8th and 15th Air Forces were assigned to SAC, the 3rd, 9th, and 12th Air Forces were assigned to TAC, and the 1st, 2nd, 4th, 10th, 11th, and 14th Air Forces were assigned to ADC. 2nd Air Force would later be transferred to SAC in 1949. The numbered Air Forces had both operational and administrative authority, and existed as a command level between major commands and air divisions. Although variations existed, and number air forces were often reassigned, this basic arrangement persisted throughout the Cold War. The role of numbered air forces changed in the 1990s during the Air Force reorganization initiated by Air Force Chief of Staff General Merrill McPeak. The goal of the reorganization was to streamline, take layers out, flatten Air Force organizational charts, while at the same time clarifying the roles and responsibilities of essential supporting functions. Numbered Air Forces were reorganized into tactical echelons focused on operations, and their administrative staff functions were eliminated. This reorganization also reduced the number of major commands, and eliminated the air divisions to place numbered air forces directly in command of operational wings. The role of numbered air forces was again changed in 2006 with the implementation of the Component Air Force CNAF concept. 
Some numbered air forces have an additional mission as the Air Force Component Command exercising command and control over air and space forces supporting a unified combatant command. CNOFs have a second designation to identify their role. For example, 1st Air Force, a numbered air force assigned to Air Combat Command, is designated as Air Force Northern AFNORTH in its role as the air component of the United States Northern Command. Most CNOFs have an Air and Space Operations Center AOC to provide command and control of air and space operations for the supported combatant commander. Topic. List of numbered air forces The table below lists current and historical numbered air forces of the U.S. Air Force, their CNAF designation if applicable, their current shield and station, and the major command Magecom, to which they are currently assigned. Note that the lineage of some numbered air forces is continued by non-NAF organizations e.g., the 15th Expeditionary Mobility Task Force continues the lineage of the 15th Air Force. Boldface indicates a NAF or CNAF that is currently active. Topic. Named Air Forces Named Air Forces operate at the same level as numbered Air Forces. General Headquarters Air Force, the first named Air Force of the United States Army's Air Arm, began operations in 1935. The GHQ Air Force became the Air Force Combat Command in 1941. Several of the numbered Air Forces began as named Air Forces. Since World War II, other named Air Forces have existed in both operational and support commands. Air Forces Iceland, and the Central, Eastern, Japan, and Western Air Defense Forces, have provided air defense capability. The USAF Special Operations Force controlled operational special forces. The crew, flying, and technical training air forces served air training command both in the air and on the ground. Pacific Air Force, FEAF, rear, controlled both operational and support forces of Far East Air Forces. Air Materiel Force, European Area, and Air Materiel Force, Pacific Area, on the other hand, served primarily as logistical support establishments. Currently, United States Air Forces Central provides airpower in support of the global war on terrorism. Source Topic. See also Organizational structure and hierarchy of the United States Air Force